Okay, this is the structure uh, right up behind uh, the spring. We're on the top back here behind uh, the Moon Lake area. This is four miles from uh, where we uh, got all those uh, um, structures over in the Yellowstone Canyon. Don't know if they're related, but we're starting to think that, um, that these alpha males have a really large territory and he'll mark a territory uh, that's in a great place for the young and the females to stay in and they kind of have their own place and uh, he goes back and forth between them and protects them. Um, he probably mostly protects them from uh, um, other males because uh, we've been in an area that we've been studying intensely and he's only been there once in four months or excuse me five months so he has 17 inches and we just assume that the females the 14 incher we see all the time there and then there's like a uh, a 13 inch juvenile and stuff that's always with her back in that area but um this yellowstone um canyon moon lake area um seems to have uh, um an alpha male and possibly resident females